If you live in the UK, then I highly recommend that you make this change to your Tesla Model 3. The number plate holder that comes with the car is so flimsy and it really doesn't look very good. And just for a simple change with some double sided tape, you can change it to look significantly better. Now to do that, you first of all just pop off this rear bit of plastic at the bottom, you pull it out towards you, and then you can just get your fingers underneath the number plate itself and just pop that off. Now to remove the actual holder, you just, with a Phillips screwdriver, just unscrew two screws. Sorry about the focus here, my camera um, had some better ideas. Uh, you remove that bit of plastic, and then next you need a Torx key. This is a Star Allen key and just remove two Torx bolts, one on the left and one on the right. Now, once you've got those out, you'll just see that it's a much cleaner mount behind. Um, so of course, you're just gonna need to clean away any grub and grime. So I'm just using a mountain bike cleaning spray here. And then once I'm done with that, I'm just using a bit of degreaser on both the back of the number plate and on the back of the car as well, just to get rid of any oil residue that might just stop the double-sided tape adhering to the car. And then once you're happy that it's nice and clean, you're ready to install the double-sided tape on the actual number plate. So I'm just using a 3M foam double-sided tape here. I think the foam just helps just with a little bit of movement and vibration, it helps it stick. And I've used that on a previous car and never had any problems. So I just did two along the top and one down the side, just making sure that it's nice and firm and stuck to the plate. Then just to make sure it's level, I'm using just some low tack gaffer tape to hold the number plate in place and then just measuring to check that it's level on both sides. Those that have watched my front number plate install video will know that that didn't go quite to plan and I wasn't very happy with that install. So I spent a little bit more time getting this right and just making sure that it was exactly level. Once I was happy with it, I just put one big bit of low tack gaffer tape along the top so that I could just lift up the number plate knowing that it hasn't moved and it's still nice and level just to then remove the backs of the double sided tape all along the back and then it's just time just to pull it down and make sure that it's in the exact same position that it was and press it into the car now the back of the car is slightly curved so you do need to apply just a little bit of force all along the plate so that it adheres all along the back of the bumper if you don't it would just stick up at one side and there you go, it really is that simple to make a change that I think is a really big visual improvement to the car. Now I'm recording this voiceover a couple of weeks after doing it and it's still firmly in place and there's been no problems with water ingress. So I highly recommend that you do this change as I really think it is a great visual improvement. I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, please like and subscribe. I've got lots more content on the way and lots more tips and tricks for your Tesla Model 3. Cheers.